<laughs> so, uh, hi, welcome to Gateway English Teaching. Students sometimes will uh, talk to me, they're confused about when to use in and when to use into. Sometimes we can use them in the same place and it doesn't matter. But here's the general difference. We use in when something is stationary, when something is not moving. The cat's in the box. The cat's in the box. It's there. But how did the cat get into the box? There's movement when something is changing. The cat's in the box. It's stationary. How did the cat get into the box? There's movement. Let's have a look at the next example. Okay, so here is another uh, opportunity to practice. They were walking blank the garden, then they walked blank the house. Which one is stationary and which one implies movement? Well, first, they were walking in the garden. And then, after that, they moved from the garden to the house and they walked into the house. 